Assalamu alaikum and welcome to Success Insider. I have changed the name of my channel because uh, uh, the old name uh, that was a bit difficult to find uh, and search on YouTube. So I've changed it to Success Insider and it's a bit good name uh, because uh, it uh, represents what I want to do, the, the journey to success. Uh, I This video is a bit late because uh, I'm preparing for my board exam. So, but today I wanted to record this video because the matter is very important. Uh, I heard, uh, uh, I have heard from the television about uh, uh, the punish a Muslim day, and I, it's very, very disgusting that uh, uh, some of the people of the Great Britain uh, had the day named uh, punish a Muslim day, in which they had um, set some points that if you abuse a Muslim, you'll get that point, ten to fifteen points, and if you um, just slap them, you'll get. So. Uh, I think that this is a totally wrong. Uh, people are thinking that uh, Muslims are um, uh, Muslims should be subjected to punishment, but um, we always uh, say that uh, it should not happen. It should not happen. But we don't try to change uh, the thinking of the people out there who uh, had the uh, this uh, terrible day. Uh, nothing wrong wrong happened uh, in this day, but uh, still it is a very alarming thing for the Muslims all over the world that people are against them and people uh, do not think that they are humans, uh, Muslims. So, uh, always from uh, 18 to 19 years, Pakistan and uh, the Muslims are related directly to terrorism. Uh, I am totally against it because this is not necessary. Uh, and in my opinion, a religion uh, any religion do not allow the killing of innocent people and uh, uh, terrorism has no religion but because some of the people some of the terrorist groups almost all of them uh, use the name of Islam use uh, uh, the uh, words of uh, Muslims and like Allah Akbar before blasting a bomb so that's very um, Thing that that should be um, that should uh, that should be discussed. So, uh, people uh, in the Great Britain and or uh, not all the people, but some of the people and uh, some of the people all around the world, they think that Muslims are terrorists. So, if we for a moment suppose that yes, the, some of the Muslims are terrorists, they are uh, they are killing innocent people all over the world. So we cannot say that. All of the Muslims are uh, terrorists. Like I have, I have as an example that uh, um, if in a hospital, uh, due to the mistake of a doctor, a patient died, and uh, a doctor lives next door uh, in your neighborhood, and uh, the people are against that doctor who killed the patient, and now you are uh, uh, thinking to punish that doctor who lives in your um, uh, your neighborhood, but he hasn't done anything wrong. So that's a similar thing that's happening out out there. That uh, the, uh, the, some of the people who call themselves Muslims are doing something wrong in the world, and then the people that you know that are Muslims, so you you are going to punish them because they are Muslims. And that similar cases will you? punish that doctor for not being involved in all that thing and not being involved in any wrong thing so you, are you gonna um, uh, punish that no no one's gonna punish him so why why is uh, this all is happening we should discuss some of things uh, that are causing this uh, not all uh, the uh, non-muslims are against uh, the Muslims and uh, not all the Muslim uh, non-muslims want to ban on burqa or niqab or hijab but some of them are so we should change their thinking we should totally um, change that perceptive that Muslims are, are the, the bad people the the word uh, the, they uh, face very um, cruel words uh, in the non-Muslim countries, like I live in Pakistan, I have no problem here living as a Muslim, and the Christians also have no problem at all in living in Muslims or all the minority communities. Then why is a uh, uh, distinction for the Muslims? I should say distinction that uh, m uh, they would uh, they would be subjected to uh, bad words and punishment and all these things. So um, as a Muslim uh, living in a Muslim country. Uh, I haven't taught how to make a bomb, how to fire a gun, because we Muslims don't do this. 
uh, my father goes to mosque every um, every day, uh, every day and uh, for the Juma prayers every Friday. So he hasn't um, told me that um, any mullah or mullah energy um, told him how to make a bomb and no mullah or mullah energy came to my house and told me how to uh, how to kill people, how to kill innocent people. So we are not like that. And reading the comments uh, of people uh, on some post where Muslims are Muslims are killed or the, the, some of the people are just saying that uh, yeah uh, it's a good thing that some of the Muslims died but everyone is human you are Christian you are human we are Muslims we are humans you are Jew you are Muslim you are Hindu you are Muslim uh, human sorry they, you you are human so everyone's human the first thing and foremost first and foremost thing is that we all are humans we uh you have a nose i have a nose you have a face you have a face two arms two legs similar things that we are humans and if we and if we uh treat someone like this then it's always a, a very heartbreaking thing for me like i'm living in pakistan that i think that the people the muslims living out there would be they're so frustrated, but they don't do anything because our religion don't allow anyone to uh, do something wrong. To to just uh, they just forgive and forget. But uh, this should be stopped. This should be stopped because of, and how can it be stopped? The thing is that how can we stop it by spreading the message that we are not um, uh, we are not terrorists. We or are not terrorists and terrorism has no religion those who uh, those who are uh, who call themselves muslims and kill innocent people they cannot be called muslims uh, from 18 to 19 years the muslims are subjected to a very um, uh, brutal behavior i should i should say it so uh, this should be changed and, uh, and if we muslims were terrorists then why would we kill our muslim brothers and sisters in in palestine in kashmir in syria in iraq in iran in all these countries why would we kill it? even in pakistan uh, pakistan has faced ter terrorism uh, um, and uh, for many years uh, many lives have gone and uh, many um, soldiers laid their lives to eliminate this uh, terrorism so in all the world in all the western world pakistan the name of pakistan is taken as the, the terrorist country we are fighting for a decade almost more than a decade to eradicate terrorism from all of the world but then after all these uh, struggles we are said that we are terrorists so that's heartbreaking we just feel that it's a slap on our face not physically but mentally and uh, we should think humans, we are humans and we should think that all other beings are also humans. Like everyone else is a human. If you think of yourself as a human, then you should believe that the other is also human. And you should not, and if, you, uh, let us suppose that someone, um, someone Muslim calls a Jew or a Christian, that you should be subjected to punishment and, uh, and the Christian would be saying, or Jews would be saying, that I haven't done anything wrong. So what would you feel when uh, some, would, some Muslim would say you? Then uh, please think that what we Muslims think when someone says this to us, that you are terrorist, while we haven't done anything wrong. And uh, the thing that uh, uh, Islam and terrorism are always related to, so I should give an explanation that uh, uh, if uh, the, uh, the people who are terrorists, the terrorists, uh, before blasting a bomb, they say, Allahu Akbar. So you say that they are Muslims. If I go out and blast a bomb, well, I won't do this, but uh, suppose that I go outside and I say the name of Jesus Christ or what other uh, religions say commonly, and I blast a bomb. Would you say me that I'm Christian? Would you say me that I'm Jew? No one would say this. Then why this discrimination for Muslims? That we are subjected to this. Uh, I think that this is very wrong, and the thinking should be changed. We should we should start a movement that would that would help the people in changing their minds. And I'm very very. Um, um, uh, thankful to the people of great britain who supported muslims and they they uh, celebrated the love a muslim day and uh, the muslims out there they worked 
they came out of their houses they helped the peoples they helped their christian brothers and sisters and uh, that's very pleasing so that's all uh, what i uh, wanted to say that we should start a movement that will change the perceptive of people that will change the thinking of people that muslims are terrorists the muslims are not terrorists at all and i am uh, 17 years old and going to be 18 in a couple of months but for in this whole life 17 uh, years of my age i haven't for a single time even seen a uh, bomb i haven't seen a bomb in my real in my life on television or in on uh, in movies and dramas i have seen but not in the real life life so we are not terrorists if i if i being a muslim was a terrorist then i, I would have guns and all the time and bomb in my backpack but i have uh, books in my backpack so we are the same as you are just a bit of change in the faith we have you believe in jesus christ you believe in you uh, whatever the religion you have and we believe in one god so that's that should not be the distinction that should not be the discrimination religious discrimination should not be prevailing in our society but it is because of our own mistakes we should we should try to overcome these uh, these problems and the we should pinpoint the exact uh, problem that is and uh, I think that uh, we should all uh, do something as as a Pakistani. Uh, we, uh, I should think I think that we should do something for Kashmir also, because uh, that's subjected to uh, uh, that's brutal uh, br brutal behavior and brutal brutality of uh, uh, of uh, the, uh, the Indian uh, government, Indian army. For about 70 years so that should be a bit um, changed and uh, I request all those uh, people all those NGOs all those people who would say that if we are humans and we should love each other with loves do something for Muslims do something for Muslims and I'm doing my best to uh, convey this message to all of you and it's up to you now to share this video so that some of uh, the uh, some of the people who have links to the uh, to the outside world that the uh, in the uh, non-muslim world so they can hear this and they can change their thinking that we are not terrorists and the comments uh, which we get the muslims get in our in my br muslim brothers and sisters in outside country the foreign countries is, are very disgusting but we don't say anything and uh, uh, because we want to spread love not threats so we should think that we are all humans and religion should be first thing is that we are humans and the second thing is our faith so being a human all the six or seven billion people living on the earth living on the earth are humans so we should treat them as they are humans not as uh, the as subjects of uh, 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 discrimination so if uh, if the Muslims were terrorists then uh, uh, why would be terrorism uh, in uh, Pakistan? Why would be uh, people killed in uh, Afghanistan, in Iraq, in Syria, in all these countries, in Palestine? So it's not the religion that determines that you are a terrorist or not. It's your it, it's your deeds. If you good deeds, if you have uh, done something good that's for humanity, then you are a good human. And if you have done something wrong, you tried to kill someone or you killed the innocent people, you are not a good person. You should be subjected to punishment by the government, by the institution that are responsible for, that are specific for all these things. And if someone has done some wrong thing, it's not up to the people to punish them. It's up to the institutions, uh, to the police department or to the, uh, the, to the judiciary, to the government that they punish them so all uh, uh, I wanted to say is this that uh, I should summarize all uh, my uh, um, this whole video uh, in that we are humans and we should treat each other with love and we should not punish each other we should love each other uh, thank you so much for watching this video share this video so that uh, more and more people uh, know this thing know this message and uh, hear this message and spread it to the uh, whole world uh, I am uh, sorry that for the late video uh, because I, I told you I was preparing for my exams and uh, as soon as my exams end up I'll uh, be uh, 
uploading videos um, in a week, uh, one in a week. So uh, uh, my exams will end up in on tenth of May. So I, uh, after that, I'll be doing something um, good, uh, better than uh, before. So thank you so much for watching this video. Uh, if you want to say something, comment below, share this video, and uh, and uh, believe in the sentence. And you should uh, think, and you should do something for the love of humanity, for the love of human beings. Thank you so much.